you can go over the bridge and go wash your hands. Meet Miss Shelley. Let's go wash your hands, friends. They love Miss Shelley. This one almost looks like the body of a butterfly. She just brings so much love and light to her preschoolers. The preschoolers at Copper Mesa Elementary. Oh my gosh, I love it. I didn't set out to be a teacher, but I absolutely love it. And she loves her kids. Every year, she gets to know a new group of two to four-year-olds. I can't even see the ninja. Can you see him? This year's group was a little different. Kids behind you! Where? Their first experience with school was through a screen. I have 13 e-learners, and then I have eight in the afternoon class who come in person. And we're going to go down. I think the biggest challenge at first with the e-learners was convincing the kids we're not a TV show. So she helped them create a TV show. I walked in the room and there's this uh, box with a kind of a uh, paper towel holder. And I said, what's this? She said, this is a camera. This is our pretend weather channel area. The weather is snowing outside. It's just one example of Miss Shelley's innovative spirit. Innovation just kind of soothes out of her in everything she does every day. Trial and error is the phrase of the year. Especially in a year with ever-changing learning models. So we planned the in-person class first, and then found a way to translate those materials to online. This is where they sleep. She found that engagement and movement were key. I would walk in there on several occasions when I saw Shelly on the floor with the the computer right in front of her uh, just doing motions with the kids because, you know, in preschool, it's so much uh, just uh, visual learning and hands-on. Once the in-person learners came back, it was time to get to know each other. Building relationships was the first step. They seem more of a classroom family now. And mistakes are part of any relationship. They all know we all make mistakes. We can just say that phrase, oopsie do. The lessons learned here are setting them up for success. Oopsie do. Success because they've been loved. We know they're going to be so very well prepared as they transition to kindergarten and beyond. By the time they go to kindergarten, I just really want them to know they're loved, they're valued, they're competent, they can do this and it's a learning process. Shelly, congratulations. I truly couldn't imagine anyone more worthy of this award. We are so, so proud of you. We are so honored that you are a part of our Copper Mesa family and just grateful that you are getting the acknowledgement that you deserve as an Apple winner. And just, we just love you. I love you. And Shelly, just echoing Jenna's thoughts, we are so, just so fortunate to have you as part of our Copper Mesa family here. Uh, you are a wonderful, wonderful human being. Um, that everyone is so excited about this. Hopefully this is a surprise to you. Uh, I know the preschool folks are gonna be excited across the district because you are so highly thought of with all of your teammates throughout Douglas County School District. And we are just so, so proud of you, Shelly, and just so thankful that you are part of Copper Mesa.